Good morning people. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different because with us today we've got some fairy liquid and we've got the MJJC Foam Cannon Pro. And just clarify, you can get the uh, Foam Cannon from Amazon at the moment. It's about £54 with the cartridge fitting on it. And I'm not going to show you where to buy fairy liquid because, well, it's fairy liquid. It's You can buy it anywhere. But today what we are going to do we are going to see if you can use this to clean your car. And just clarify, I'm, I'm going to say now, I probably wouldn't recommend cleaning it with this, but over the years, all you ever see online is, oh, you shouldn't do this. Like if I just Google, can you use fairy liquid to clean the car? It says, no, it'll take off your wax. No, it'll crack your paint. Uh, it will strip it away and make the paint dull and unprotected. So I'm not trying to fact check any of these, you know, um, I just want to see, well, let's just see if it actually works or anything. So that being said, Let's get into the video and let's get to it. I'm going to pour in the water first now so you can see this is just water going in the lance. This isn't boiling hot, this is just warmish water because I bought this quite a while ago. And then when I'm outside with the car, I will put this in in front of you and then I'll immediately start using it. So, shows you that I'm not lying, this is going to be genuinely straight from that. And uh, yeah, let's get out to the car. I can only apologise for my shoddy recording at the moment. My screen mirroring on my GoPro isn't working, so I can't see what you can see. But the way to test how strong this fairy liquid is, actually on half the windscreen, I'll bring you a bit closer. On half the windscreen, I used... I used Soft 99 on it, so you can see that this side has got a coating on it and that side doesn't. So when I clean the car with fairy liquid, let's see if it actually takes off this coating on the windscreen. Hopefully you can see that. See, this side's beading and that side isn't so that being said let's just get into the proper bit and i've seen a couple videos online with fairy liquid where people have said they've put it in it so like with this one they poured in red fairy liquid and then when they've gone to the car it's then green so they haven't done it properly so for this one i'm going to show you it properly so this is just water and in goes the fairy liquid Put a fair bit in there, make it nice and red. I don't really know what's going to happen here. Hopefully it's not going to strip the paint off the panda. You know, fingers crossed anyway. So that is now filled up. Let's give it a stir. Wipe this back on. And hopefully we've still got white paint on the uh, panda by the end of this. So I'll keep it in screen so you know I'm not lying. So, wrong way. so on it goes. And uh, let's see what happens. <laughs> So, that smells amazing. What flavour is that? Well, what flavour is that? What smell is it? That is pomegranate and honeysuckle. Uh, you know what? We always do a taste test on this channel. So, on it goes. <laughs> it's amazing how it can like dry your mouth out and be wet at the same time. That's disgusting. So. As we can see, I foamed it up. Well, I tried to foam it up. Obviously, it's not the greatest for it because it's very liquid. Although saying that, I thought it would do better because when you're, at, you know, cleaning your pots and pans at home, it sizes up pretty well. So, uh, you know what? I was going to wash it off, but you know what? Let's just add some more fairy liquid to it. So, do even more. A bit of money, watch the bottle fill up. You know, we're not scrimping on the fairy liquid. 
It does smell really good though. It doesn't taste great, but it smells amazing. Let's stir it up again. Oh look, see, I'm doing this all on camera so you can see that I'm not lying. I'm doing this properly with fairy liquid. Okay. Let's go again. That's a bit better. <laughs> Still taste that. It's bleh. That's much better. Look at that. It's up now. Right. Look. 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 Look at that. I would say that's probably like a, a cheap branded snow foam if you went somewhere. But very liquid is probably about a quarter of the price, so I don't think it did too bad there. So I'll speed it up, I'll clean the rest of the car, and uh, we'll see how it looks. So, Panda's now clean. I did dry most of it, and it looked alright. Plus side the paint hasn't fallen off yet so that's always a plus but um it has actually cleaned it really well you know it has got off most of it i will be honest i wasn't used as much elbow grease there are some little bits on there that if i scrubbed a bit harder i would get them off but due to it being very liquid i didn't want to overdo it just in case it did do any damage to it or something like that but let me show you the windscreen so i cleaned it properly with the fairy liquid so let's see if it actually took off the um soft 99 coating Hopefully you can see this. So if I hopefully you can see it on the camera, but even the fairy liquid couldn't take off the um, coating. So it does show that the fairy liquid isn't actually as strong as we all probably seem to think it is. So yeah, I think fairy liquid does quite a good job of cleaning your car, just for the once though. So obviously I'm probably not going to say use it multiple times because then you might do damage but for a one-off clean it seems to be okay so she said she wanted me to clean her bicycle as well so i'll give it a clean but i'm going to be using this so let's actually try and make it as foamy as possible i'm going to do the garage door as well actually sod it why not then you can get a good look because that's black and this will be white so let's just let's just squeeze loads of it in there just keep going keep going use up like half the bottle keep and let's keep going Oh, missed most of it. See if we can make it really, really foamy. All right. Give it another stir. It's all right now because I don't really care about a bike anyway. So if it strips off the paint, not my problem. And on it goes. Again, I'm only doing this just to show that it is genuinely just very liquid and nothing else. So smash the camera here we go and stuff so it won't rust so don't have a go at me but yeah so if we just look at what I've done there so, so providing you use literally half a bottle of fairy liquid you don't get a bad foam I mean that is really really thick so yeah so I'm doing all this stupid stuff so you don't have to so hope you enjoy the video and uh Thanks for watching.